Hi, good evening to you both. Yeah, this all happened right around 245 in a neighborhood just about four minutes away from here near the corner of Lamberton Streets and Kimberly Ave. Now we were able to speak with the bus driver herself firsthand. She tells us that she was driving along that street, Lamberton Street, when she heard those shots ring out. She felt something strike the bus and of course was pulling away as fast as she could onto a side street, checked on the kids and then called police. Now we were on Button Street talking to a mother and her son as they were being reunited. When he got off the bus, the boy told me he was sitting right where the bullet raised the bus. He and his mom tell me they are thanking God for keeping him safe tonight. Both, of course, clearly shaken up by what happened. Another mother I was also able to speak with tells me that she was getting her child off of a different bus in the area when she heard the shots ring out. A terrifying moment for her as well as she says that her kid was coming off the bus. She heard the shots. She saw a lot of people running away, of course, then brought her child to safety. Now, police tell us that nobody was injured in this incident, not anyone on the bus and not anyone off the bus either where those shots rang out. Of course, they will keep us updated if anyone happens to come into any area hospitals with gunshot wounds. But right now, no reports of anyone getting struck by gunfire in relation to this incident. Now, we did reach out to the New Haven Public School district. They tell us that after hearing about this news, they are just very happy that these students are now safe and sound home tonight with their parents. Of course, very scary for the parents tonight as they heard about this news and heard the great news that their children were all okay. Again, four children were on that bus and they're all doing okay. Nobody was injured. The best case scenario. We're live here in New Haven tonight. Julia LeBlanc, Fox 61 News.